Thank you so much for helping my project. Absolutely. Could you say a couple words about yourself? Yeah, my name is Zach. I live in Alvin, Texas. I'm 29 years old and I work for Dish Network. <laughs> That's awesome and uh, persistent, uh, willing to get through any problem and make it work. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. We got it going today. So, um, uh, well, uh, did you know that NASA is planning to send astronauts back to the moon? Oh, okay. I, I was not aware of that. Okay, um, now that you've heard about it, uh, is it something that thinks good, bad? Um, I mean, what, are, what are your thoughts? Um, well, I don't think it's a horrible thing, you know, as long as technology has come so far and uh, I just feel like it's going to be, um, there's stuff that's happened in the past, but you know, it's, it's safer and safer. Um, I don't think it's a horrible idea. There's probably so much out there. There's so much out there that, that we have yet to discover in space or way deep down in the ocean. So mm -hmm. I think it's cool to, to have those advancements. And, you know, whatever you think back over how far humanity's progressed in 200 years, uh, you know, we didn't have uh, computers, we didn't have cell phones, we didn't have dish, we didn't have automobiles, uh, all that 200 years ago. And if you look forward like 200 years, um, you know, who knows where you might go, but do you think by that point we have people living on the moon and Mars and like you're setting up the dish uh, places there? Ooh, you know, that, that's a tough one to comprehend. I, I personally would would say no. I just okay. I, I can't comprehend the the technology, the oxygen. All, there's so many factors, and I don't know if 200 years is is enough. Do, do you think it would happen at some point, and that's just not enough time, or you think uh, we're forever just kind of confined to the earth? In my personal opinion, I think forever confined to the earth. I really do. I, I don't know if we could actually move and live and you know have a, a community there. Okay, um, and if you had an opportunity to go to space, would you take it? Although it, it seems very scary, I absolutely would because I just feel like the view, especially the view, just, you know, I bet you feel so small, uh, but being able to look down at the earth, that would be cool to visit space if I absolutely had the opportunity. That would, um, well, I think you'll probably get a chance in your lifetime, actually, considering the way things are developing. So it may not be as theoretical as you think. Right, right. Yeah. <laughs> no, yeah. Um, definitely, you know, visit. I wouldn't want to stay there. Uh, sure, <laughs> just go take a look at the Earth. No, yeah, that would just be phenomenal, once-in-a-lifetime type deal. Yeah. Well, Zach, thank you so much for your time. I really yeah, uh, yeah. great getting to talk to you. Absolutely, thank you.